Hello everyone. This is Mr. Musab. I want to solve the worksheet for you. Okay, start with the question number one. Now we want to prove that these two triangles are congruent. Now here, uh, the two triangles are right triangles, and we have uh, congruent hypotenuse, and uh, we have common side here that is RT. So the triangles are congruent by HL theorem. HL theorem. Okay. Now let's fill the blank given that RT is congruent uh, RT is uh, perpendicular to SU so these two triangles here RTS RTS and RTS and RTU are uh, right triangles okay well, they are congruent also. Because perpendicular forms like right angles, okay? And RT is uh, congruent to itself by a flexible property, or what we call it common side. Okay, and it's given here that is. RS is congruent to RU so the triangles are congruent by HL theorem ok uh, question number 2 if uh, the measure of the angle RST The measure is 46 was the measure of the angle RU2. It will be 46. Why? Because if this uh, RST is 46, this one is congruent uh, to RST because we have isosceles triangle here. So this angle will be congruent. Okay. Question number three. Write a proof from the diagram. What we have here that uh, we have both uh, right triangles. Okay, we have uh, one side here, one leg is congruent to one leg, and we have the hypotenuse is common side here. It is DB. So these are the three conditions. Uh, to use the HL theorem. Okay. It's simple. Now question number four. Look at the exercise. This this exercise. Can you prove that these triangles are congruent uh, without using uh, the HL theorem? Actually, the answer is no. We can't because we don't have enough information. Look here. We can't use uh, uh, SSS or uh, because we don't have a three congruent sides. This side is not congruent to this. Okay, uh, and uh, use any any of uh, the former uh, theories like uh, SSS or. Uh, SSS doesn't work, side angle doesn't work, okay, because we don't have any idea about this triangle, this angle. We can't prove that these two angles are congruent in any way. If given that these two lines are parallel, we can use the uh, alternate uh, theorem to prove that this forms as it Letter than these two triangles that will be congruent. 
so it doesn't work and the other also doesn't work so the answer is no and I'll give you the explanation okay question number seven this is simple and most of you will solve it correctly now here uh, x will be 17 because they given that these two triangles uh, are congruent they are two right triangles so the hypotenuse will be congruent to the hypotenuse here type uh, okay here also x will be 3 because uh, the hypotenuse here is congruent to the hypotenuse and the leg is congruent to the leg so x will be 3 question number 10 Question number 10 we have here you should form a, a system of equations okay so these two triangles are congruent because they are right triangles the hypotenuse will be equal to the hypotenuse so 2x plus 1 will be equal to x plus 3 now and we have another equation x plus y equal 3x minus 3y okay now solve this shift x to the other side and 1 to the other side it will be 2x minus x equal 3 minus 1 x equal 2 okay. now substitute here instead of x will be right 2 plus y equal 3 times x x yeah, which is 3 times 2 which is 6 minus 3y now solve it for y you will get 4y equal 6 4 which is y equal 1 uh, I shift negative 3y to the other side and 2 to here ok so for this question x will be 2 and y will be 1 go to the other one you can pause uh, the video to write the answer I read and solve the other one now 4x plus 1 will be equal to 13 because we have two right triangles congruent so the hypotenuse is congruent to the hypotenuse solve it 4x will be 12 x will be 3 uh, now let's solve the other equation remember that x is a 3 ok so 2, two x plus y equal 8 x minus 2 y we so find x x is a 3 so this is 6 plus y. 3 times 8 which is 24 minus 2 y Solve it for y, you will get uh, 3y, shift this to the other side, equal 24 minus 6, so 3y equal 18, y equal 6, this is the answer, okay? Type, question 13, write a paragraph, given that is ad, ad, here bisects EB so this will be congruent to this now simply we have two tri right triangles because we have the right uh, sign here right angle sign and the hypotenuse is congruent and we have one leg uh, one leg congruent to one leg AC is congruent to CB because uh, the AD is bisector so it divides EB to two congruent sides okay it's simple now question number 13 what additional information would prove each pair of triangle congruent which information would prove each pair of triangle congruent by HL here we have three conditions both of them should be right triangles so for this question we should say that this should be right triangles should be given 
the happiness is here is congruent okay and we have one leak that's enough uh, the other one also the same thing we, we should add that these string is are right now we get, have one leg congruent to one leg and the hypotenuse is AC is uh, congruent to itself because it is common side or we call it reflexive reflexive property or as we uh, we call it in the class common common side Okay, question number 14 uh, here given that both are right um, what more we need to we need additional information that we need the hypotenuse is congruent and we should prove that rs is congruent to sv okay or uh, excuse me sorry no need for that because we have here ts TS is a common side, so, so it is enough to prove that RT is congruent. We need here to prove that is RT is congruent to two EV. Uh, both are triangles, and this side TS is common. No need to uh, to we don't need to prove that RS is congruent to. As we no need for this. Okay. Okay, the last one. The last one is uh, we need to prove to add that this to happen as uh, congruent. Okay, the last question. Are are the triangles congruent? Explain. Okay, both are right. The hypotenuse. The hypotenuse here is 25 but the hypotenuse here is unknown the leg is 7 here is 7 we don't have any idea about so no they are not uh, they are not uh, congruent or we don't know if they are congruent or not because the hypotenuse here is 25 and the hypotenuse here is unknown okay Good luck for all of you. Bye-bye.